Hello everyone, welcome back to Pabli. So in this video, we are going to understand the top five Shopify automations to enhance your business using Pabli Connect. So I run an online Shopify store and I have created some amazing automation to automate my Shopify store using Pabli Connect. So here in these automations, I have built some automation to add order details to Google Sheets, create Pinterest pin for new Shopify products, generate product descriptions for new product, and also sending WhatsApp notification to customers for every new order. So to learn these automations step by step, let me take you to my screen. Welcome to my screen. So as you all know that I am an owner of an online Shopify store and in this video, I'll show you how to automate essential tasks for your Shopify store to save time and streamline your operations. We will cover five powerful automations that are how to track order fulfillment details in Google Sheets, generate unique product descriptions using Google Gemini, send order notifications directly to customers on WhatsApp, enroll buyers in Teachable course upon purchase and create Pinterest pins for each new product you add. These automations not only keep you organized but also enhance customer experience and expand your reach. Let's dive in and see how each of these can simplify our workflow and drive more engagement. So firstly here let me tell you about this amazing automation software that I have used to build all these five automation which is named as Pabli Connect. So Pabli Connect is an amazing automation and integration software and it connects all your favorite apps and makes them work together seamlessly. You can set it up to do things automatically like updating customer info across platforms or sending notifications when something important happens. It's really easy to use and saves you tons of time that you can spend on more important stuff. Plus it keeps everything organized and error free so you can focus on growing your business hustle free. So this is the homepage of Pabli Connect and you can visit it by simply browsing for the URL pabli.com slash connect. Here you can see two options that are sign in and sign up free. If you're a new user, click on sign up free and get 300 tasks every month to explore the software. And if you're an existing user, click on sign in. Here I'm an existing user so I'm clicking on sign in. Now after signing in here you can see all Pabli apps window where you can see all the applications of Pabli. Here to build my automations I am going to use Pabli Connect. Now this is the dashboard of Pabli Connect and from here you can create all these workflows. So here on my screen you can see all the top 5 automations that I have created to automate my Shopify store using Pabli Connect. So now one by one I am going to show you all these automations and describe their working. So for now let me take you to my first automation. So here on my screen you can see my first automation that I have created for how to add Shopify order fulfillment details in Google Sheets. So so here I've created this automation to save all the order details which are already fulfilled in my Shopify store. So here you can see that I have created this automation using Shopify and Google Sheets and here I'm using Google Sheets as my database to store all the order fulfillment details. So here I've used Google Sheets but you can use any other database such as Microsoft Excel, Notion or Airtable. So now here let me move further with my automation. So here you can see I've taken my Shopify in this trigger step over here and here I've taken my trigger event as order fulfillment so that whenever an order is fulfilled in my Shopify store then automatically Pabli Connect should capture the response and after capturing the response over here I have used a feature by Pabli that is data transformer by Pabli to extract the values from the array that I have received in my Shopify's trigger step. So here I have used data transformer by Pabli and I have taken the action event as line itemizer and now here after setting up this action step I have connected my Google Sheets in another action step where I'm adding all the order fulfillment details received in a new row of my Google Sheets. So by setting up this entire automation, I have made my work easy of simply managing all the order details which I've already completed for my Shopify store. So this automation is going to save a lot of time of yours and is going to help you to save all the order fulfillment details of your store at one place. So this was all about this first automation that I have created using Pabli Connect to automate 
automate my Shopify store. So now let's move to another automation that I have created to automate my Shopify store. So here you can see the second automation that I have created for automatically generating the product description for my Shopify store. So this is the entire automation that I have created to generate the product description of my Shopify stores using Google Gemini. So here you can see I have taken Shopify in this trigger step where I have used my trigger event as new product. So that whenever I'm going to add a new product in my Shopify store, then automatically Public Connect is going to capture the response. And after adding the new product over here, I have used Google Gemini to generate the description for my product which I have added in my Shopify store so that my customers can get good and brief description of the product that I have added in my Shopify store. So now here to generate the product description using Google Gemini, I have connected my Google AI Studio that is Gemini in this action step over here and after generating the content using Google Gemini, I have updated the product details in my Shopify store in this action step over here. So here you can see I have connected my Shopify account again and here in this action event I have used my action event as update product so that after generating the product description automatically the description of the new product launch should be updated in my Shopify store. Okay so these were the steps that how you can automatically generate product description for your Shopify store products and by building this automation your customers are going to receive attractive description for your products and this may help your business to grow very fast. Okay, so this was my second automation that I have built for my Shopify stores. So now let's move to the third automation that I've created using Public Connect. And here in this automation, you can see I've created this automation to create the Pinterest pin for my new Shopify product. So here by building this automation, my objective was that whenever I'm going to launch a new product in my Shopify store, then automatically I want to create a pin for that same product in my Pinterest account as well so that my customers can get updated over there also. So here to simplify this entire process, I have built this automation where I've taken my Shopify account in my trigger step over here and here I've selected my trigger event as new product so that whenever I'm going to launch a new product, then automatically Pabli Connect is going to capture the response. And after that, I have used a feature by Pabli that is Data Transformer by Pabli in this action step where I've used my action event as strip HTML tags. So here I've used this particular action event because I was receiving HTML tags with the detail of this new product launched in my Shopify store in this previous trigger step. So here to remove the HTML tags, I have used this feature by Pabli that is Data Transformer by Pabli. And here I've taken my action event as strip HTML tags. Now here after removing the HTML tags, I have used another action step over here where I've connected my Pinterest account with Pabli Connect so that whenever a new product is going to launch in my Shopify account, then automatically a new pin for that product is going to be created in my Pinterest account as well. Okay, so these were the steps to how to create a Pinterest pin for new Shopify product and by building this amazing automation, you can automatically update your customers at different platforms. So here I've used Pinterest but you can use Facebook pages, Instagram to update your customers as per your need. Okay, so this was my third automation. Now let's move to another automation that I've created to automate my Shopify store. Okay, so here in this automation, I have created this automation for enrolling the user in Teachable code for Shopify purchase. So here in this automation, I'm selling an online course through Shopify and here I want that whenever an order payment is made for that particular course, then the customer should be enrolled in my Teachable account under that specific course. So for that, I've built this amazing automation and here I've taken my trigger as Shopify and my trigger event as order payment so that whenever the order payment is made in my Shopify store for that particular course, then automatically Public Connect should capture the response. And after that, I have used a feature by Pabli that is filtered by Pabli here in this action step to filter the values. So here in this action step, I have added the filter on the product purchase because I want to enroll the user in my Teachable account for that particular course purchase. So here in my filter step, I have set up this filter on this particular course for which I want to enroll the new users through my Shopify order payment. So here I've set up this filter and here in this action step, I've connected my Teachable account with Pabli connect to enroll the user in that particular course. 
so that whenever a order payment is made in my Shopify account, then automatically it is going to cross check the filter value of that particular course purchased. And after surpassing this value, it is automatically going to add a new user in that particular course in my Teachable account. Okay, so these were the steps to how to enroll user in Teachable course for Shopify purchase. And by building this automation, you can easily add the customers to different CRM and LMS platforms in single click. Okay, so this was my fourth automation. Now let's Let's move to my last automation that I've created using Fably Connect to automate my Shopify account. Okay, so here in this automation, I'm sending Shopify order notifications on WhatsApp. That means here I'm going to send a WhatsApp notification to my customer on every new order. So for that, here I've taken my trigger as Shopify and my trigger event as new order. So that whenever I'm going to receive new orders through my Shopify store, then automatically my customer should receive an instant WhatsApp message using template message through WhatsApp by AI Sensi. So here by connecting WhatsApp by AI Sensi in this action step, I'm going to send an automated WhatsApp message to my customer on every new order so that I can engage with my customer and my customer should feel connected with the trust on my store. So here I've used WhatsApp by AI Sensi to send the WhatsApp message. But here you can see WhatsApp Cloud API, Varti and also you can send the SMS notifications by connecting an SMS sending application such as Twilio in this action step over here. Okay, so these were the steps to how to send Shopify order notifications on WhatsApp. And with this, I've completed the discussion of the five powerful automations that I've created to automate my Shopify store using Pabli Connect. So I have used these applications to automate my Shopify store, but you can connect different applications to automate your Shopify store with Pabli Connect as per your requirement. So with these five automations, you can now handle order tracking, create compelling product content, Content, keep customers updated, offer course enrollments, and boost product visibility on Pinterest all without the extra manual work. These integrations make it easy to manage your Shopify store efficiently and focus on growing your business. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more automation tips. Let's keep your business running smoothly with less effort. Now, if you want to use all these workflows, then you can find the clone link in the description box for all these workflows. Workflows. I hope you like the video. Thanks for watching. Not only these applications, you can integrate many other applications with Pabli Connect. So now if you have any doubt, then you can email us at support at the rate pabli.com. And if you have any query, then you can reach out to us at forum.pabli.com. And if you have any pricing related issue, then you can simply visit our website that is www.pabli.com. So now if you liked our video, then please subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends.